Hi guys, Kirk and Jay here with Kirk Giordano Plastering with another tip of the day. You guys keep emailing me, Kirk, what's the best trowel to buy? I see a lot of uh, stainless steel. Is it worth the money? Or what's the best hawk to buy? Um, we got beat up lately. The truck, I broke the lock on here. Here it is, so it won't lock. And water is pouring in here. And I thought, oh man, water for trowels is <laughs> like kryptonite to Superman. It's, it beats him up unless they're stainless steel. I'm gonna show you guys something uh, real quick about stainless steel trowels because you guys ask. Okay, this is uh, very wet in here because it got you know, seven days of rain. Uh, we're in Oakland, it's uh, February, and man, we, had a, we got beat up with rain. Okay, stainless steel trowel. These guys are good because they don't rust as easily as mild steel, or you can get Carbon steel, um, carbon steel. I like the carbon ones for interior use too. They don't rust anywhere near, and all you gotta do for carbon or stainless steel guys is put a little mineral oil on them. But if you're like me and your box is left open and the water for seven days goes in here and it mixes and they're setting on the face, even those can rust and the more you use them, uh, they can rust. Uh, the stainless steel guys are the best trials to buy, bar none. Uh, carbon steel. I like the carbon also because I do a lot of interior and carbon is, it's a, it's a stronger or a solid metal, uh, just it's stainless steel and they put more carbon in it. But with me, I like the carbon because it's uh, the blade when we're going in interior, it just uh, can bend, it can flex. Stainless steel is a lot harder than carbon steel, guys. See that, this flexes. So when I'm doing interior, I like it. I like the carbon. Here's something. Okay, all of these trowels are sitting in water and sand. Now they're not bad, but let's find one that is uh, <laughs> mild steel. Mild steel will rust almost daily if left in the cold, cold weather or the middle of the night. And it's been down to about, I don't know, 40 degrees. That's pretty cold. Not snowing, but it's, it's cold. And with the water, it'll rust the crap out of the tools. So to answer that question, guys, buy stainless steel. Um, we do a lot of videos. I think we got 900 or 800 videos. And when you guys ask me questions, no matter what it is, I try to answer it. This is almost like an infomercial, but you guys asked me about hawks and trials, so I thought I'd explain it. Uh, we're on a job now, and I'm just getting here. I'm thinking, man, my truck got beat up the last couple of weeks. Jay's been in Spain, and I haven't been working because it's pouring down rain. For hawks, guys, you want to get a 14-inch hawk. That's the that's the biggest ones they have. Marshalltown Courier are both good brands. Uh, this is an acrylic hawk, and these are both sitting on the bottom here. They they sit at the bottom. If they were submersed in water. Some of these, as you use them, they do get beat up, guys. They'll rust big time. Anyway, this is just a, a quick tip, guys. If you're going to go online and buy these tools, uh, buy stainless steel trowels and buy 14-inch hawks. I can go into detail about a lot of things. Even my brother Lou, stainless steel knife, Lou's out for a while for the guys who watch us regularly broke his foot. He has this stainless steel knife that he cuts his lemons every day with at lunchtime. Uh, so anyway, stainless steel is the way to go for knives and all that. And if you do get a trowel or a hawk that's so beat up like this, all because you left it out in the rain one measly night, you could use a stone to get it clean. You could use uh, emery cloth to get it clean. Or do what I do often. I'll just go on the ground, not in somebody's front of the house, but in the street or so. And it'll come right off, guys. So uh, if you want to avoid doing that, buy the stainless steel ones. In every description we do, there's a link to Amazon, and it has the ones that we prefer to use because I took the time out to, to figure it out because I had to take the time out for the last 35 years to, to know all this stuff. Anyway, guys, there's so much more to talk about as steel and all that, but that's just the basis for you guys asking me which particular trial to buy stainless steel guys anyway my name is kirk jason on the camera we thank you for watching and as usual we'll see you guys on the next one by the way folks my dad and i are now members of amazon affiliates so if you're looking to buy any of the plastering or construction tools you've seen in our videos and you want to support us in the process you can check the links below our video or you can go to our website and get them there if you have any other questions that for tools we don't have linked email us direct and we'll respond to you then 
Once again, folks, we thank you for watching and I really enjoy all your comments. If you guys like this video, please click the like button down below. And also, if you enjoy what we do, subscribe to our channel so we can keep making these videos for you. My name is Kirk. And Jay. We thank you for watching. And from the entire Giordano family, we'll, we'll see you on the next one. one.